Hey, what's up, guys? So this video will be a quick update on Tezos. So when I made my last video about Tezos, we've been breaking out uh, right here. I think we've been trading somewhere around $6.20. And I was mentioning that we have to break out and take out all these spec holders right here in this range between $6.20 to about $8.05 and retest this uh, resistance successfully as a new support area to be able to trade in the next days in, the, in this range again between $6.37 to about $8.02. So as you can see guys, exactly this scenario played out right now. If you take a look, if you take a closer look at the four hour time frame, guys, you can see that we broke out from this resistance line right here. So this huge squeeze to about six, uh, sorry, seven dollars and fifty cents. And now we retested about eight or twelve hours ago this previous resistance around six dollars and forty cents successfully as a new support guys so yeah in the immediate short term tezos is definitely looking quite bullish right now and my next immediate short term targets what i would be looking out for guys would be first of all if this uh retest of this support area at six dollars and forty cents can hold in the next hours because i think if we will retest the support area right here again and we cannot hold it and start closing some candles again below the support area we could maybe experiencing some price action like we did right here at this uh, head and shoulders pattern if you take a closer look you can see that we have here one shoulder right here this head and then here the second shoulder and if you would fall down from here right in the next hours around six dollars and thirty cents and we would start closing some candles again below the support line uh, i think we will see most likely an extended sell off back to retest this support area right here again around five dollars and eleven cents and then we would we would have the same price action like like we did right here guys so we would have the first shoulder right here then we would have right here this head and then we would have right here the second shoulder so, so that would be quite dangerous for tezos if this scenario would play out because i think we will see then most likely an extended sell-off like i already said back to retest this significant support line around five dollars and uh, ten cents again so yeah otherwise if you take a look guys we have also in the four hour time frame this uh short term uptrend right here if you take a look you can see that since we retested this support line right here successfully around four dollars and fifty cents we have right here the first low guys around five four dollars and fifty cents then we have this higher low right here around five dollars and 82 cents and now we have this third low right here around six dollars and 56 cents guys so yeah i think if we can hold this very aggressive trend line in the next hours i think we will see most likely a bounce to retest this previous top right here at eight dollars and six cents where we've been rejected really hard at the past price action if you take a look right here if we cannot hold this aggressive trend line i think we will see uh, most likely a uh, retest of the support area right here and if we can retest it successfully i'm expecting a sideways consolidation in the next one or two days maybe in this range between six dollars and 14 cents to about eight dollars and ten cents guys so i think you will trade most likely in this range right here in the next uh one or two days maybe but of course it also depends how we will react to the support line right here and of course also what bitcoin is doing in the next one or two days so don't be too confident guys and for all of you who want to trade tezos in the short term and who want to make a long position for example right now so for me there would be only one possibility guys to make a long position in the next hours and that would be if we can retest this support line right here again successfully around six dollars and 35 cents then i would enter my trade right here if we will see some buying strength is coming in then i would set my take profit target at this previous high at around eight dollars and three cents where we've been topped out recently and a very tight stop loss somewhere around yeah somewhere around six dollars and three cents so this would be definitely a beautiful trade guys because if you take a look you can see uh, that we would have a risk reward ratio of one to five so if this trade would work out that, that would be definitely a very profitable trade and yeah like i already said i would re i would wait for a retest of the support area then i would enter my trade around six dollars and 35 cents uh, then I would scale out 50% of my position size at half of my target around $7.20. After that I would set my stop loss back at my break even point where I entered my trade to make sure that I don't make any losses anymore. 
and just in case we are pulling back to retest the support area right here again and then of course i would take out 100 percent of my position size at my take profit target right here and also this previous high around eight dollars and seven cents so yeah guys this is definitely my game plan for the next four to eight hours like i already said watch watch out how we will react to this trend line first of all but this trend line is quite aggressive in my opinion and there's definitely a possibility that we are falling down to retest this support line right here again and uh, otherwise if we can hold this trend line right now i think we will trade in the next hours in this range between six dollars and ninety cents to about eight dollars and two cents to retest this previous high right here and like i already said if we start closing candles below this support line right here around six dollars and thirty two cents i think we will trade uh, in the next days in this range between six dollars and forty cents to about five dollars and two cents guys to retest this support area right here again so yeah this is the quick update for tezos if you enjoyed the video guys please give me a like subscribe to my channel and if you have any questions just comment down below check out my links in the description and hope i will see you in the next video thank you for watching guys bye bye